There's a saying out there you probably heard before, eat, drink, and be merry. This weekend certainly rings true. Tomorrow is Cinco de Mayo. Celebrations well underway, though, not just tomorrow, but also today. So why not plan a get-together for the whole family? Mm -hmm. Style expert Amanda Puck is here to show us how to eat, drink, and be merry with Mexican-inspired foods, drinks, and a cool new game. Yeah, this is a big weekend. Derby, Cinco de Mayo. Oh, you know, I know. Where do we start, right? There's so <laughs> many things happening this weekend. So let's go ahead and talk a little bit on the Cinco de Mayo side. What do you have lined up for us here? Well, I think Cinco de Mayo is one of the, the holidays where you can really throw something together very easily because everyone loves, you know, Mexican food. Everyone loves guacamole. So I'm bringing a, um, showing a guacamole recipe today that's a little different. Okay. Easy to make at home. So for people who like to cook at home, it's really simple. Um, you take avocado. And the key with making really great guac guacamole is that the avocados need to be really fresh. So when you go into the grocery store, you really yeah. want to find an avocado that has a really soft, you know, very fragrant, because that's going to make the best guacamole. Okay. All the ingredients should be super fresh. So and the your producer manager will be so happy, huh? Yeah, exactly, <laughs> exactly. Yeah, every one of them. Exactly. <laughs> so what you want to do is you want to remove this hard little top right, right there right. when you're taking it off. And then the way I like to do it is you just simply cut around like this. Yep, I do that exact thing right yeah, there. Yeah, so easy, right? And then you just literally twist the avocado, so you see how gorgeous it is. And then I uh, like to, to be fun, you can kind of, you know, stick the knife in and turn it and like do a that. Yeah, yeah a little trick. Yeah. And then all you have to do is take the avocado and you scoop it. So you don't really have to. The thing I like about this is I'm not really like I don't like chopping. I'm not, you know, I can't really dice things that well. So this is fun for me because you can really quickly make it without having to, you know, really chop. Right. You know what I do? Uh, this is not my segment, but usually I kind of <laughs> squeeze, squeeze it. it. Yeah, I you do squeeze that too. it out like this. Oh, there you go. There you go. There you go. There you go. And you know what? That's going to help you mash it later. So that's right. a perfect idea. That's great. That's okay. great. And then the thing about guacamole too is, you know, I love going to restaurants where they make it table side because you can say, oh, I want extra garlic or extra onion. So you really can kind of, you know, be um, pick your own amount. So I don't know how much garlic you guys like, but we can put some garlic in here. We'll what do you like in there, Mark? Well, you know, I'm, I'm looking at that mango. I'm wondering why we're doing mango. Okay, so here's why we're doing mango, because I don't, sometimes I just don't love spicy. Yeah. And I think this is a fun variation. Instead of adding a chili, we're going to make it a little sweeter and oh, add some mango. I like but that. It, but it's the same thing. You re the mango really has to be fresh and sweet in order for, um, you know, really to make an impact in the guacamole. That's nice. So yeah. you mix all yeah. that in? Mix it all in. Little cilantro, throw it all in. Little, little lime. cilantro. Yeah, and, and the lime is key, because what's going to happen with the lime is that um, it's going to have the avocado not turn brown. So right. We really want Why don't to we have you move on to this? I'll mix this up. Perfect. Okay, great. Yeah, a couple of drinks here. here to make, couple too. Of drinks. Yeah. Okay, so margaritas. This is the freshest margarita in the world. We're using Milagro because it was voted one of the top five te tequilas by GQ under $25. Really, really simple way to do it. You want to take lime. A lime. Okay. Stacey, you're doing pretty good. I'm thinking, this. where are the chips? <laughs> yeah, they're right <laughs> over, over there, actually. They're already. Yeah. So we're going to squeeze the whole entire lime in here. Gotcha. There we go. That's the key to that That's fresh the key. lime juice. Yes, and then when we mix drinks, we really like to measure because we want to be completely accurate with mm -hmm. our recipes, um, and it's also to drink responsibly. So we're going to add two parts of Milagro tequila. Okay. Like that. Now again, this is simple. Everyone, you know, wants to use a mix, or you know, do I use uh, different liqueurs? Do I use triple sec? I like to use agave, which is a natural sweetener. It's actually a little bit healthier than using um, a simple syrup or a. Mm -hmm. um, Mm -hmm. Sugar. Right. Okay, gotcha on that. And here we go. And that's actually And you it. just toss it in the blender? Yep. No, I'm gonna, well, you can if you like frozen margaritas. Right. Or you can shake it out. And it's all good to go. All good to go. Okay, perfect. Now, you also have the entertainment side right over there. It's, you know, I love to have... Um, these kinds of celebrations should be for everyone. It should be for kids. It should be for families. I love, I love having these things. I got them from Etsy, little mustaches that you can kind of have with the kids. And this game. <laughs> Anytime it's the things they have fun I, with. It's so, so fun. Yeah. And this is Mexican I don't want to stop you, but I'm going to have to go because I know we're running short on <laughs> That's time. Okay. So thank you so much. Totally appreciate it. You thank can you. Dig into the guac. You want to try the mangoes there? Oh, yeah. Let me keep. So yeah. definitely, if you want to get your party started, we posted all the information on Amanda's recipes. And she also has some party ideas, too, that we didn't get to get all the way through here. So please go to our website at abc7chicago.com.